Time for a half dollar hunt. All right, well, I opened all of our boxes to see what had the most marked ends and to look for silver enders. Um, so I picked out of those boxes the worst, or at least what I thought looked like the worst to do for this video. So you can see this one has more than a few, at least two that I can see, marked coins. So you know the drill, we'll bring you in if we get a find. Roll number 46, and I think we've got another 1982 Philly no FG. Let's take a look. It's definitely a Philly. And I think that's definitely another no FG. This makes two. What do you guys think? No FG? I think it's a no FG. I think I'll add it to this one that I found. Roll number 50. All right. All right, that finishes off box one. We do have this 1982 Philly no FG that we found. So I will uh, set this aside and bring you in for the next box. All right, let's look at our next box. And as you can see, we do have a few more coins. So I'll bring you in if we get a find. Roll 50, box two of this hunt. So roll 100, depending on how you're counting. Bad tear. Let's see if we can get some bad tear luck. And that's a big negative. All right, so so far all we've found has been an 82 Philly, no FG. I will bring you back in to open the next box. All right, box three of this hunt, and there are a few marked enders, but uh, not much else. So you know the br drill. Cut. All right, box three of this hunt, and you can see there's a marked ender here or there. So, um, you know the drill. I'll bring you in if we get a find. Roll 50 or 150. Uh, let's roll 50 of box three. Still skunked. And... Looks like the massacre of the skunk continues. I will bring you back in to take a look at box number four. Uh, marked ender... Looks like an NIFC ender, so maybe our luck will uh, turn the other way. So I will bring you in if we get a find. Huh. I think... Oh, we do. Look at that. Gold-plated. Well, slightly gold-plated. Bicentennial. So roll number 10, and we've got a slightly better gold-plated... 72 Philly. Interesting. Maybe we'll start finding something else. Let's get back to the hunt. All right, here's the next box. As you can see, it's got one marked coin so far. So you know the drill. I'll bring you in if we get a find. All right, this is the last box of this hunt. And there's quite a few marked coins, so we'll bring you in if we find anything. Roll number 33, and we've got a proof. Two thousand three. Nice. Whoa, same roll. And it's a ninety six proof. This one's a little worse for wear. All right, roll number 48, and it looks like we've got a proof and something else I'm not sure of. It's a little too reflective to be silver. This is definitely a dirty proof, and it's a 1990. Let's see what this other guy is.
Hmm. It's counter stamped 1960 to 1980. I'm assuming it's, I mean, it's a 83P, so it's probably plated. I don't know if it's silver plate or what, but uh, different. A lot of plated coins in this box. All right, so that brings us to the end of this six box hunt. Uh, we didn't find any silver, so we definitely got silver skunked. We did find this 1982 Philly that appears to be another no FG on it. So we'll put that with the other one. I'll probably submit it to see if I can get the designation. Uh, we found three proofs. A 96. A 2003. And a 1990. Uh, and then we found three plated coins. Uh, two are gold. Well, this one was almost gold, but it looks like uh, someone's failed attempt. Or they colored it with paint, a marker, something or another. But uh, this also was unsuccessful. You can see from the edge, the gold plate did not quite make it everywhere. Uh, and then we had this last find, which is an 83 Philly, counter-stamped 1960 to 1980. Uh, it's plated in, I don't know, silver-esque material. Don't know if it's silver, nickel, whatever. Um, kind of interesting. If you've seen one of these before, uh, not in gold like this one, uh, let me know down in the comments below. But uh, that brings us to the end of this hunt. So if you want to see more of my videos and if I've earned it, I hope you'll click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications of my next video. If you like this video, I hope you'll give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. As always, thanks for watching and happy hunting. Mm -hmm.